Hello everyone, this is Sun Collect here with another action figure review, and sorry about not posting so much. I am still way behind on the action figures. I've just been <coughs> busy with finals and uh, and uh, my costume. I finished that up uh, before the movie, so that's all done. Now I can get started on getting back into the reviews and stuff. I got a bunch of new figures here and more coming up, but besides that, let's go over to the um spider-man figure here so first we'll go over to packaging so first we get the game reverse logo here on top spider-man miles morales logo down here from the game here is the camouflage spider-man uh promo art there here is the back of that figure with the figure there and a the description there's no build a figure piece with there or anything like that marvel legends logo here in the top right same artwork on the other side here is the top with the miles morales logo there and then here's the bottom with the dcpi but besides that, let's crack them open. And here is the camouflage from Fire Man Miles Morales out of the package. So let's go over the accessories. So first, we get tooth whipping hands made out of transparent plastic with some blue hint to it. So these are the whipping ones. You can kind of see the guards, uh, the knuckle guards uh, molded in there. So yeah, you get two of those. You get two of these electrified hands, one for each hand, I mean. And you get these electrified like details glued onto the hand on the forearm. And then the yellow transparent hand here. And then we get two wall crawling hands here for him with the blue transparent plastic also with the knuckle guards molded on there. And then that's all we got for accessories. So this Spider-Man figure is basically the same exact thing as the Spider-Man Miles Morales figure. It's literally the same thing except that they're using transparent plastic, which is blue and they painted some like little light blue here but let's go over to here so like i said it's the same mold so yeah you get all the cobwebbing sculpted in here you get some of the texturing on the suit sculpted in you can kind of see the inner workings of the figure itself too like you see these little pieces here where they they usually put pig uh pigs in there same thing on the elbows so yeah you get the uh for the lenses here you get it painted uh, a little bit of a light blue and then white around the lenses there you get a little bit of splotch in there or scuff you get that little light blue there for the spider look which looks great and then the lining you get a little bit of that on the forearm guards and more lining there on the shoulders on the belt all the way around and then on his back spider then you get some more on the little linings around his knees and then the feet too on the heels so yeah it's pretty cool and then so yeah i can't really say too much there's not a whole lot going on with it but it's still a really cool figure i really like it um it's basically the same exact thing except like less color i guess and it's transparent plastic and it's blue so let's go over the articulation so he has a double ball jointed head which goes down that much up that far back I mean, it moves left and right lots of head pivoting there shoulders can move out that far 360 rotation bicep swivel uh shoulder um shoulder cut uh, sorry double jointed elbows pretty far wrists can hinge down that far up that far 360 rotation he has an ab crunch that goes that down that far backwards that far he has a waist swivel 360 rotation there legs can kick out that far forward that far backwards uh, a little bit thigh cut double jointed knees pinless by the way also with the elbows and then ankles can hinge down that far up that far nice ankle pivot and here is the camouflage spidey next to the spider-man miles morales figure for the no way home wave so like i said they're basically the same exact thing except this one's transparent blue plastic whereas this one's actually like black and red like his regular colors are so yeah so yeah, that's all I really got to say about this figure. I really like this figure. He's awesome. Uh, like I said, like the Spider-Man Miles Morales figure is easily top 10 favorite Spider-Man figures I have, or favorite figures I have, actually. So it's basically the same thing, except it's just trans transparent plastic, like I said, and it's blue. Uh, you get the same uh, accessories, ex besides the Builder figure piece that um, this guy came with for the New Way Home Wave. But besides that, I, I actually recommend you get him because he's a cool 
um, addition to the Spider-Man figures or Spider-Man collection. Um, and then you can do some cool stuff with this figure. Like if you're doing stop motion animation, you can do something like this where he turns into camo, camo mode. So yeah, um, I, like I said, highly recommend you get him. He's a GameStop exclusive. So make sure you check them at, check out GameStop for that. Um, but yeah, that's all I really got. So if you guys want to support me on TikTok, Twitch, or Instagram, uh, go ahead and check out my link tree in the description. But besides that, thanks for watching.